Welcome back to educator.com. Unless you have skipped ahead directly to this lesson, you've already looked at a couple of units uh, just uh, as you come across them in CSS. Um, but this lesson is going to kind of give you the details on all the important units that you'll run into and uh, talk about some of the differences between them um, so that you can make intelligent decisions about which unit to use instead of just uh, going by which one I've used in the lesson. You can now uh, choose your own units as you build your own code. So the first uh, units we'll look at are the units that determine how to uh, set a color. Um, and there's a couple of different types of notation. Um, and they're all uh, equally good. Uh, there's not any one that's any better than the other. It's just a matter of preference and uh, what's the most convenient to you. Maybe uh, what you uh, what you find uh, the most familiar. So first notation is uh, hexadecimal notation, and this is um, if you can read in in hexadecimal or count in hexadecimal, it starts with zero. Uh, which is the lowest number, and goes up to 9, just normally. Um, and then after 9, you don't go to 10, you go to A. So that has a value of 10, B, C, D, E, F. Um, so if you count that up, that's 9 plus A, B, C, D, E, F, 6. And that gives you the total number. So each one of these uh, character spaces has that range instead of just you know, your normal 10 if you're using alpha numeric, uh, or just alpha uh, let, uh, characters. So what this does is, um, well, there's two. No there's actually two. There's sort of the shorter hand and then the full version. You break this up into uh, red, green, and blue. So these two characters are the red, these two characters are the green, and these two characters are the blue. And right now, F F F F F F. That's the that's the highest value for all of them, and that creates white. Um, and this character right here and this character right here are like, uh, I mean, think of it like decimals. So like this could be like 15, um, 1, 5 would be higher than, if this was F0, that would be like, you know, in decimal it's 10, 1, 0. If you have the 0 here, uh, that's, that just kind of like adds to this. So what, what this is, is it's just a, a, a two character hexadecimal notation value for what to make the red. Um, and then the same thing for green, and then the same thing for blue. So you can make uh, thousands, probably hundreds of thousands of colors with this. Now the shorthand notation is almost the same, except you don't have the full um, you don't have the full uh, amount of specification because you don't get this secondary thing. So this would be kind of like just the tens, like in, in decimal, it would be like if you just had the tens. So like 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, and you couldn't specify like 12, 25, it just you know, rounds it to the nearest 10, only you're, you're doing it in hexadecimal, not, not decimal. So um, uh, F, again, is the highest, so that's going to be the full for red. And what it actually does is it, it doesn't actually put a zero behind it in this, in this sort of shortcut notation. It, it just copies whatever this was. So um, F, this will be FF. If I'd had like a 3 here, then it would be 3-3. Three, three. Um, but this is FF, 0, 0, 0, 0, so that's full red, nothing of green, nothing of blue. That's going to turn out as just full color red. Okay, so the RGB notation, if this is confusing to you um, and you don't have a background in computer science, this may be if you have more, you know, uh, graphic design sort of background. Um, you can use, you have to, this is part of the value now, so you, you have to put this RGB and then the parentheses. Um, and then you put the red, green, and blue values in here. Um, and uh, th so this is kind of like, you know, when you have a URL, um, which you've probably run into before if you've gone along lessons through to now. Um, and then, so there's two ways to do this as well. You can do it in terms of percent. So this would be 100% red, 100% green, 100% blue. And if you forget which one is which, you can just look at this little RGB <laughs> that you've typed in right there, red, green, blue. Um, so this 100% of all makes white. And then um, down here, you have another notation where it's not in terms of percent, it's a value. Um, and 255 is the, full, uh, is the full amount. So that would be equal to 100%. And this just happens to be the same as the totals of the, of the hexadecimal notations. So um, this is actually, this gets you the same range as this because with two digits, 
in hexadecimal, you can count up to 255. Um, and, and that's why you're using hexadecimal instead of just decimal because it takes three digits in decimal to count to 255. Um, so this 255, 255, 255 is white. That's four on all three. Um, anything, you can just scale down any, any of these other numbers to create any of hundreds of thousands of colors that you want. Um, if, if any of these are, you know, if, if you have trouble memorizing some colors like, uh, you know, FF, F00 is red, 0F0 uh, would be green, 00F would be blue. You can combine them to like create purple, just basic color theory. CCC would be gray, 000 would be black. Um, you can do the same thing in here. If that's not convenient for you, you can always use these keywords. And actually browsers have implemented a lot of other keywords that you can use, but um, it's best to stick with these because these are actually part of the standard and you're more guaranteed that every browser will uh, use these. Um, so these are just some colors you can use as keywords and you'll see me in the lessons doing this a lot um, where I just type in the name of the color and it automatically knows, you know, blue will be uh, 0, 255 or 00, 0 255 um, and it, it just computes it that way. Um, so here's a couple of quick examples. These are all the same color and you, the, the commas separate the different ways of indicating this color. So red you could just type in red, or you could do the full hexadecimal notation or the shorthand hexadecimal notation. Um, this is 100% 0, 0, in red, green, blue, or 255. Same thing with green is uh, in the middle here. Um, blue is here at the end. Um, white is um, the full value for all of them, and black is the smallest or the zero value for all of them.